Hello everyone, how are you? Today we are going to revise Unit 3 Lesson 1, which is Food Relationship Among Living Organisms. Food is the main source of energy for all living organisms. So the main source of food is the plant. How? We said before that plant make its own food by photosynthesis process, okay? And some living organisms feed on plant directly. These are called herbivores. Like what? Like the deer, they feed on plant. Also the rabbits feed on plant. Other living organisms feed on plant in indirectly way. These are called carnivores. Like the lion, like the tiger, they feed on, for example, a rabbit, they feed on uh, deer, which they eat before plant. So these are called carnivores. Okay, the types of food relationship. We have three types of food relationship. First one is predation, second, symbiosis. Three saprophytes. Okay, let's start by the predation. First type of food relationship. It's a temporary food relationship. It ends by devouring the prey or part of it. We said that temporary means muakkata. Okay, so the food relationship between the predator and the prey is a temporary relationship. Okay. Predation in animals must be between two, predator and prey. The animal which devours other animal is called predator, but the devoured animal is called prey. Okay, also predation in plants happen, but it is less common in plants than the animal. Plant also feeds on some insects to get their protein. Like what? Like the Drosera and the Dynea. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives the plant some ways to defend themselves against predation. Okay, so the first way is camouflage. Camouflage is a phenomenon which Living organism can change its color to simulate the environment. Also to hide from predator. Like what? Like frog, like the butterfly and chameleon. Second way is mimicry. Mimicry is a phenomenon by which harmless living organisms imitate to be harmful. Like the bee. The bee is a harmful living organism, but it looks like wasp to escape from predators. Second, symbiosis. Symbiosis is a common food relationship between two different types of living organisms. Symbiosis has three types. Mutualism, commensalism, and parasitism. Okay, first, mutualism. Mutualism is a food relationship between two living organisms. They both get benefit from each other. We have an example between the nodular bacteria and the leguminous plant. Okay, amalu deal ma'bad. So the bacteria fix nitrogen to the plant while the plant gives the sugar to the bacteria. But they both get benefit from each other. This is called mutualism. Okay, second, commensalism. Okay, also it's a food relationship between two living organisms. One of them get benefit and the other neither harm nor get benefit. Also we have an example here <coughs> between the tiny aquatic organism and the sponge. Tiny aquatic organism here means the fish. Okay, the fish take takes the sponge as a shelter, okay, while the sponge neither harmed nor get benefit, okay. We'll stop here and we are going to complete the lesson next time, okay. Yalla, see you ala khair, bye.